Professor D here. Have you ever wondered about certain questions you have about the scripture? Like, are there families? Is there a family with God? You know it says on earth as it is in heaven. Well, exactly what does that mean? Do we really see the whole picture or are we just kind of saying, well, no, that just can't be. So let's go to the scripture. Let's go to the very, very beginning. Let's go to Genesis, where it says in Genesis 1, 26, And God said, Let us make man in our image, after our likeness. Now it's our, which is plural. It's not singular, it's plural. That means two, at least two. And God said, Let us make man in our image, after our likeness. And let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, and over the fowl of the air, and over the cattle, and over all the earth, and over every creeping thing that creepeth upon the earth. So God created man in his own image. In the image of God created he him. Male and female created he them. So male and female, hmm... So does that mean there's a female God too? Could that possibly be? Hmm. Now, if we look through scripture, do you think we're going to find something like that? Do you know, in Sabbath school one day, a little boy who was, I would say, all of four or five, raised his hand and said, Miss D, who is the Holy Ghost? Is that God's wife? Me being ignorant, thinking I knew something, I thought, oh, how sweet, this little boy. I said, oh, no, 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 that's just another part of the Godhead. Now think about it, folks. It says, except we be as a little child. This little child saw something that I did not, because I have been taught wrong all these years. Yes, there is a family in heaven on earth as it is in heaven. And we will see throughout that this family is spoken about. The whole family on earth, the whole family in heaven. But just like on earth, there is one who is the head of everything. In the family, it's the Father on earth. In heaven, it's the Father in heaven. Now, who was it that the Savior said to pray to in heaven? Did he say pray to the mother? No. Did he say pray to him? No. He said pray to God the Father in, his, in the Savior's name. So, what is the question then? Why can there not be families up there as down here? Throughout history, whenever the family was dissolved or broken apart, the whole society fell. And that is what is happening today. People are having such problems because instead of letting God be the head, they're letting someone else be the head. 